the? Uh. That ain't no money. What do we got? A provisioner. I'm just gonna take the provisioner. I I do like Junk Winder a lot too. This card is really good. Actually, you know what? I'm gonna junk. Oh baby. <laughs> <laughs> Junkwinder into Scour. GG. G freaking G. Um, Flay Essence is quite good. Mongrel's quite good. Agony's fine. Fire Ice is fine. I'm not taking the Dray Keeper here. Might just take Mongrel. I don't know. Flay Essence is... Nah, let's take Flay Essence. Exile is too strong. Just double white, double blue, double black. Garth won! Oh. Mm, damn it. There's a Tragic Fall and Yearling. Both are insane. Okay. Gosh darn it. I guess we're doing this. Let's start staking some lands, I guess. Probably even want Strike It Rich if it comes back on the wheel. Mind Collapse is good removal. Uh, I bet you Lens Flare is going to be better in this deck, though. Just because I'm going to be wanting to play so many artifact lands anyways, that this is probably just going to be cheaper removal, even though I have to be casting it on an attacking or blocking creature. Piercing Rays or Bridge. Let's take the Bridge. Milliken. <laughs> the real question is, why are you looking at Twitter and Twitch at the same time? Is Garth worth it? If we get to activate once, it'll be worth it. I'm probably supposed to be baseline green with this, aren't I? Damn, it's a lot of, uh... Oh wait, this is five mana. What's better here? Oh, Quirion Ranger with, uh... <laughs> Garth. <laughs> uh... I can't see myself running Foul Watcher in this deck. I guess this has land cycling, although I don't know if we're going to be running that one. Uh, no, no, no. We already have Scour the Desert. This is so good with Junk Winder, too. This Flay Essence is questionable, maybe. I promise you, chat, Garth will be in the final version of the deck. Uh, Yavamaya Elder? That's fixing. Another Flay Essence. Another Scour. <sighs> Flay Essence is so good. I feel like I need to... <laughs> I feel like I need fixing. But I have no green cards right now. Yeah, let's just take another Flay. Okay, Companion. Like, I don't really have much of a reason to be blue. Oh! This can turn one of my lands into an island. That's fixing, right? White, black, splash, Garth? I mean, how hard can that be? Oh god, these green cards I'm passing make me so sad. Ending is good here. The Dermo Taxi. See, black green or green white land. Both give green, and both are one of our main colors white or black. 
So I'm not sure what land is better here. I guess we have double black early. This card's pretty good. <laughs> Man. Good, 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 good. Fine. This is not going to be good in our deck, though, so. Nah, I have a bunch of tokens. Of course I should just be black-white, but we have a Garth. I think I'm going to take the Starfish. Okay, more land fixing. I don't think we want Knighted Mirrors in this deck. My god. <laughs> Just a little, put that over there, and then move all that over there, and then, uh, <laughs> uh just a little bit over that, and then over there, just move that. Wow, last pick, Arrow Amoeba, too. You better give me some money if I'm going to do this. God damn it. Just another fat, thick, white bomb card. Ugh. Passing a world. Oh, bitties. Shard. Karmic guy, dude! Our deck's nuts. Passing Knight. Ornithopter. Charger. I think I just want another starfish here. I do want another reanimate effect, but I guess I already have two sort of ones. Mm, this card is just okay, I think. Wait, no, this exile. Oh, wait, I guess I don't have any big black creatures. Fine. It's fine. Disciple of the Sun. Don't really have too much to get back with that. Maybe Knighted Mirror is okay here. There's only one reason to run these artifact lands right now, the Prismatic Ending. I don't think we have any other utility. Oh, I guess I have the Sojourner's Companion. That's going to end up being a cut if I do that as well. Ah, shoot, and I have the two lens flares. Awkward. I've been pretty happy with this card. More than unbounded potential. <sighs> Boo! They put too many good cards in this pack. I'm going to take the tutor. I want to take the knight. The boons, Dees. Chat, forget about your Garth. I'm sorry. Constable? I've never been on Constable. I think that card is not very good. You promised! I promised nothing. Do I need a third Soul of Migration? I, don't I didn't take any of the late to dinners, which is kind of awkward now. So maybe we just want more artifact doo-doos. Torque? That's not bad, actually. A little bit of ramp. Bone shards. That's fine with all my tokens. Damn, super late Shikari, too. I don't even think I need the flares. We have a lot of other good removal already. Hey, we wield the fish. But I have three knighted mirrors, so I'm guessing that the unbounded potential... The other starfish uh, scried, not surveilled. I guess this got better, too. 
The boon came back. Dang. I don't think I'm going to be running the Echoing Return, but I have duplicates of Soul Migration and the Knighted Mirror. Drop the black entirely? I don't think so. I'm going to drop the Sanctifier and just bring it in from the board as necessary. <laughs> drop the League! You took a Garth and you didn't play it. I probably don't need the Torque. I guess Disciple's not that great. That's probably fine to cut. Not running any of these white cards over here is kind of awkward, though. All those poor artifact lands I've taken. I kind of want to try out the Altar of the Goyth. This counts both graveyards. I'm going to give this a shot. So I'm really good with Knighted Mirror. You can probably cut the Piercing Rays. Alright, let's go like this. 10-7 should be fine. I could even go 9-8, but I think 10-7 is probably a little bit more ideal. Alright, let's go. No! My opponent knows my shame! They know that I'm running the Garth in the sideboard. <laughs> Shame. 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 <sighs> Uh-oh. Time to get wrecked by the Chrysalis again. Deepwood Denny. I'll be okay with the trade if they offer. Question is, what are we going to tutor for? Whoa. Do I just block? Probably. Before they can tuck it away, I don't know. Gives me two card types in the yard. Not irrelevant. <sighs> Alright. Could go get Karmic Guide. Could get Scour. 611 flyers. Yeah, Karmic Guide looks like good value here. Do, 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 do. The creepy crawly. Alright, take four. That's nice. Get to flay the 4-3. Now we can cycle the Kolos, which will give us our 7th land for a guaranteed Enforcer. And uh, can, karmic by, can Karmic guide the Kolos back if we want to as well. We'll see. I mean, I might... I, maybe I just hard cast the Kolos next turn. Depends what they do, really. Right, yeah, because we can save the... But versus blue-green, like... Oh, they gave me squirrels accidentally. That's super awkward. <laughs> it's target player with both modes, right? Yeah. Oh, that that's so awkward. Because they would have been able to make some 4-4s four here. That, wow, that just completely warps the game. That's so awkward. I feel bad, but I mean, what can you do? I'm not going to concede because I could very easily just win. 
I guess I just won't attack with the tokens. I don't know. This is this is just weird now. That's magic, baby. Yeah, just say F it. Sucks. <laughs> Concede aside in Garth. Oh, is 17 more than 16, chat? Gets double strike in combat uh, if you have more life than the opponent. At the beginning of combat, it's a trigger. Bounce! You freaking cheater. They probably chump now? I don't know. Oh, maybe not. Oh god, they all fly! Flying squirrels, flying crabs. Now I draw pro creatures. Bam! Imagine only getting two 1-1 one, one flyers for five mana. Ooh, I guess I just gave them an extra 4-4, didn't I? Eh, this might not have been a good attack there. Oh, they didn't even block it. Good. God, is this even worth... This might not even be worth. I guess I'll just wait. I suppose I should have played my land in case I want to cast two fives next turn for some reason. Oh. Squirrel turns into a beast. It's pretty good. All right, so they have to chump here. I'm taking another hit. All of a sudden, flyers! Flyers! Uh, this is only sorcery speed. So if that illegal play was a legal play, yes, perhaps. All right, we will bring in the prismatic ending versus tokens. What's up, Amoxin? I think I missed your 32-month resub. Sorry, thank you, friend. You know, I'm pretty sure I'm not running that many swamps. YOLO. <laughs> Swamp? No? Okay. Uh, yeah. <sighs> hmm. Not running that many swamps. I think we're on seven swamps and then the um, the Kolos land cycler. So we have eight black sources in the deck, right? At least. This is game two, I am up a game, yeah. Should say it on the uh, overlay. What do they do? Oh, they recalibrated after cycling to draw a card. But they still missed a land? Swamp! Alright. That plays. No, it was probably closer to 90%. You're not wrong. On any individual draw, the chances might be low. But the odds of seeing one of eight cards in the first however many 
actually kind of high. Yeah, actually 90%. That chrysalis is about to start uh, kind of wrecking me. I'm gonna make a four four. I'm a four four. I'm gonna make a four four. That's a four four. I'm gonna make a four four. You're a four four. Because they have the chrysalis gives their tokens flying. Hopefully they just activate this again. No bounce. No bounce, it's cheating! I think my opponent just cheated. I ain't paying for that crap. It's 10 damage next turn if I kept it, but we can buy it back later. Okay, let's flay the beast. And you start getting these removal spells out of my hand since I can only cast one every turn. Uh oh! Good thing we have another removal spell for that. No, it didn't. I think I'm going to put it on the fish. My mirror is going to be scary enough as it is. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Damn it. All your damn stinky flying tokens. Bug. Blacksmith skill. No. Don't need it. Uh, attack into the specimen collector before they get a four four. So yeah, this way they can only copy a crab or a squirrel for now, or the clue. Yeah, I needed to pick up one of those late to dinners during the draft. I think we saw two in pack two or something, and then we didn't see another and I didn't take either of them. It most certainly is. Yeah, it doesn't do much right now. Oh, it's a pretty hot draw. All right. No, this card's good. It's dirtily, but it's good. Usually this format isn't super fast, so. Did they choose the right modes this time? They did! <laughs> All right, they're just double jumping. Bloop! You thought you were the token maker? But it is me, the better token maker. Uh, 
<laughs> Boyd's. Boyd's gonna Boyd, baby. All right, BRB. Yeah, we can keep this. Got turn two cycle Kolos for a swamp. Turn three can flay essence if we need to. Turn five, six, one, one, fly us. Salvaging. All right, so they're on the red black madness deck, which means, but -da, 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 da pro your deck, get wrecked. Pro deck, get wrecked. 3-1 can't block, cascade as long as they're delirium. That could be even good. I don't even want to kill that. But if I don't kill it now, I'm going to take a bunch of damage from it since it's going to be two more turns before I can scour. So. I would take six damage. I guess that's worth well, yeah, Madness, the cards never hit the yard first, so. That is definitely what I want to kill. And now I've used all my removal, so time for you to play Chainer and kill me. Burbs. I live in the sub, Burbs. GG go next. Bone shards, one token. <laughs> I didn't mean it. <laughs> oh, Asmorano gonna accept my hand like that. And they have the cookbook. You think I need those burbs? Oh. Sorry, Bo. Sorry, buddy. I'll just have to go hungry now that I've killed your cookbook. What does this do again? Pay three life, sack it. Return target creature card from your graveyard to the battlefield. It's activate only as a sorcery. I don't even have anything good in my graveyard. Three, two, flyer. Yeah, that's good. Well, <sighs> I'm thinking of a fat angel. I don't care which one. I think I might want to kill their madness enabler. But then again, if they rip a removal spell for my knighted mirror, all of their three toughness creatures can attack. Yeah, I think this play makes sense though. They're due for some lands, right? They've gotten five land all spells. Yeah, they're due for some lands. All right, with that draw, I think I will attack. Six you? It's times like these you learn to learn. Spear. Spear, spear, kill, mirror. All right. I can bring that back still with my priest if I want to. It's a good draw. I'll just five to unearth. Might be able to kill him next turn here. Oh wait, I'll be one short, won't I? But force is a chump on the knighted mirror. Okay. Um, um, I think we want to bring in the Prismatic Ending as well. 
Prismatic, Sanctifier. Um, take out the Altar. Probably don't need Boon so much versus them. I have a lot of flyers already. Any of these cards could be good too. Any of these three removal or even the Disciple seems good. Actually, I guess this on two is not very exciting, is it? Probably be better just to bring in the Piercing Rays. Eh, we'll bring in the Disciple. 3 3 Flyers, D or sorry, 3 3 Lifelink is Dece. What color combination is the strongest for draft? Uh. I don't know. Seems like all the color combinations I've seen so far have been pretty good. No, I don't think five color is necessarily the best. I guess I won't flay yet. I'd rather just be able to trade here. Obviously this gets value from the yard later on, but um, we have two 1-1 one, one flyers here to just block the random 3-1. Sure. Let's attack for one, leave back one bird to block in case they can kill the Disciple here. Spear shoot, sure. I think we just level this up EOT. Four, 14. Five. Four. Six, 12. Okay. Not this turn, but next turn. Mm, six mana, three, three, ouch. All right, they're hellbent. That should be game over, right? He did the math. What? Jeez. Hmm. Ugh. Well, that's going to be an easy discard to bone shards. I've never seen this card really pop off, but if they're green black, they're going to have a bunch of squirrels. And other nonsenses. I'm not going to block if they attack since again we have the double soul of migration here next turn. Uh oh. Uh oh. I was hoping they wouldn't do that kind of squirrel nonsense though. We'll see if firing off the bone shards too early ends up costing me, huh? Oh, not good.
Nice that they didn't do anything on last turn cycle. They could just be dead next turn if they just play like their Dray Keeper or something and I draw Pump Effect, you know? What was that? Oh. Splashed Break Ties gets me. This bird can fly so high! Ka! Alright, so maybe they're straight up three color. Boo! Boo! Oh my god! Did they just live the dream? Must be nice. Alright, I guess we lose. Alright. So, using that bone shards ended up uh, costing me a little bit. I mean, I have a decent amount of removal, too. Oh, man. These hands, though, have not been... <sighs> I guess. Keep. Yikes. They did, yeah. They had seven at the end. Solitude. Touche. Oh, lordy. All right, I mean, if I draw land next turn, I probably can't win. <sighs> That's not bad. I don't want to have to proactively use my tricks. I want to wait for them to do something. They could just pump their dude here end of turn. Damn, I wish I had my uh, Skyclave boon back. Or Sky Blades boon back. Oh, uh, too many blockers. I guess I kind of have to kill the Dray Keeper now. Fight. Blech. That ain't good. <laughs> All right, come on. Where's my ain't? I have not even seen it once. The big seven mana seven seven. Give to me, please. Please! Please! I don't think we drew it once, did we? Yeah, looking pretty dead here.
Just keeping my bird alive. Alright, we got smashed. Never even seen it. <laughs> <laughs>